Hey, Jerry, we have a question that came in about flirting, and it's from a guy, and at his office, his place of work, he's flirtatious with women, and his wife has gotten wind of this. She doesn't like it, understandably, but he's saying it's just harmless fun. What do you have to say to that guy? Well, I have to say flirting is fun, and it gives you a rush. And, you know, my, my adage is, I'll flirt with my wife, you flirt with yours. I want to reserve <laughs> that fun for my own spouse. I actually saw this happen in a church I was in uh, when I was much younger. But there were a couple of couples that would socialize a lot together. And the husband of one and the wife of the other would flirt in front of the other uh, of their own spouses. And it was wow. all in fun and isn't this great and, you know, we're just kidding and wouldn't you like to run off with me and that type of thing. But it happened that one of those couples ran into a little marital discord. It wasn't even about the flirting. It was about something else. And there was tension. And so the, the wife that had been flirting asked the other guy at one point if he had ever been serious about this. And they got talking about, yeah, there's always been a little spark. Two marriages broke up. And as you know, those new marriages don't last long either. Mm. And so really, it was just a mess. And, and as I say, these were church people too. So I would reserve that flirting. My dad was a law enforcement officer his whole life and police chief. He always said, flirting is like looking down the barrel of a loaded gun. You might get what you're asking for. <laughs> that paints a picture, doesn't it? Yeah, so uh, what I hear you saying is, hey, it is not just innocent fun. Reserve your flirting for your spouse. And that is solid advice. Jerry, thanks so much.